hello friends welcome to our channel and in this video we will discuss about conditional formatting and in the conditional formatting we use the two functions like how we can color the cell if it has the specific text like if it has the pass so it will indicate in the green color and if it indicates the fail so how it will color in the red in the same way if we can find the condition in the cells so we can also find the condition in the font like if it gives the sales uh, less than millions so how it will indicate in the red color and if it gets or if the sales gets l more than a million so how it will indicate in the green color like in the status if the person got less than 60 marks so he will be assigned fail and in the fail he will give in the red color and if the person got more than uh, 60 marks so it will indicate in the pass and in the pass it will give the cell color green and in the same way we use the condition formatting for the font like if the alarm make the sales of million so it will indicate in the green color and if the David makes the sales of less than a million so it will indicate in the red color this let's start our example we have the name column we have the marks column and we need to find out the status first so that we can use the conditional formatting here so we have given the criteria so we can use the status here like if the person got less than 60 marks he will be assigned fail and if the person got 60 or more than 60 he will be assigned pass so if the person got 50 how we can assign the status by using the formula so we use here if function like equals to if bracket open now in the logical task we select the cell like if the person which is 50 gets greater than equals to 60 marks comma inverted comma he will assign pass inverted comma close else he will assign fail inverted comma close bracket close like if d4 equals to or greater than 60 he will assign pass and if this statement is not true he will ultimately assign fail now if i press here enter so we got fail because the person got less than 60 marks if the person got 60 so he will assign pass and if the person got 59 so he will assign fail this is the first step that we have done now second step is to use the conditional formatting first i select the whole column in which i use the status and now i go here in the option of conditional formatting and in the option we have the new rule or manage rule i select the manage rule and in the manage rule i give the first rule which is use a function which is format only cells that contain and in the cells we have this format and in the format we have the specific text state blanks so we use a specific text like if the person gets pass so we go in the format and in the format we get fill in the fill we get the green color now okay and again i just use okay this is our first rule like if the person gets pass so he will get green color now another rule again go here in the format only cell and go here in the specific and the specific i go here in the fail and the fail i again use the format and in the format i use here red color and again go click here click and apply okay so you can see here if the person got 59 so he will assign fail and if he assign fail so he will give in the or the color will indicate it as red now i just need to 
track it down so apply the formula on the all cells so you can see here on every cell if the person got less than 60 he will assign fail and the fail will indicate in the right color like if the person gets 92 marks so it will convert into green color and if the person assign less than 10 or if he assign 10 marks so it will automatically convert into red color this is how we have changed the cell color and in the next example we have the data in which we change the figure color now like we have the employee id and we have the employee name and third is the sales column like if the person earns or if the person make the sales of less than 1 million so it will indicate in the right color if the person makes the sale of more than 1 million it will indicate it in green color so how we can use it first we select the whole column in which we want this condition formatting now I go here in the conditional formatting I go here in the new rule and in the new rule again we select the format only cell in the format only cell we have the options and in the options we have the greater than or less than now if I just select the cell which is less than if the value is less than million go here in the format and in the format we need font so in the font you can see here I first select the italic and if the sales is less than million so it will indicate in the right color you can see here the reflection I press here ok and again ok now I need to use another formula as well so again go here in the condition formatting and go here in the manage rule so we have already made the one rule now I select the new rule and in the new rule I go here in the former cell and again go here the greater than if the sales is greater than so we can consider it if the sales is greater than nine hundred and ninety nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine which means equals to a uh, million or more than million so I will assign in the font of bold and in the bold the color will be in the green and click here I just press here ok and I use last tab which is apply and press here ok so now if Alon make the sales of 100,000 so it will indicate in the red color if the David make the sales of 1 million it will assign or it will be indicated in the green color if the Peter make the sales of more than a million or 85 million so he will be or it will indicate in the green color in the same if it will case in a million so it will case in the hundred and if I use less than million so it will indicate in the red color this is how you can use the conditional formatting for the fonts as well and for the columns as well this is how we have used the conditional formatting in detail if you like the video please share and subscribe and if you face any confusion please write in our comments